Hello, everyone. Dan here from the Next Issue Podcast. On today's video, we'll be doing a review for Batman Superman World's Finest number 27. This is a new book from DC Comics. Let's talk about the creative team before we get into this book. This book is written by Mark Wade with art by Dan Mora and Travis Mercer. Timer one villain colors, letters by Steve Wands, and you'll see some more covers at the end of the video. Stay tuned for that. Uh, let's talk about this issue before we get into the actual review. It is an implosion of global proportions as Mix and Batmite flee the dreaded doom might of the fifth dimension. Batman and Superman must travel to the fifth dimension to do battle within a dimension of omnipotent mayhem. All this plus the march of the Legion of Doom Mites, an absolutely adorable weapon of mass destruction in this startling second installment of the latest world's finest epic. Uh, this has been a truly unhinged event, as you could probably tell just from looking at the cover, right? Anytime we have the fifth dimensional beings involved, things are going to go bananas. Uh, it's really fun to see other versions of like the Legion of Doom uh, as these uh, fifth dimensional beings. Uh, and just I can tell that uh, Travis Mercer and Dan Mora are just having a really fun time drawing a lot of this stuff. Uh, you could just like, so you know, sometimes you just feel it. Uh, let's go take a look at the art so we can talk more about that. This is this is what I'm talking about in the first page. Obviously, an homage to Batman the animated series, right? Uh, even even Batman, Bat, Batman just saying, I am the might, uh, you know, changing a, a little bit of wordplay there. Uh, and then just catching up with Mr. Mix the Plick. And the, like I said, every version of this Legion of Doom. This is it's like Looney Tunes here with the, the world's finest. Uh, I love seeing Wonder Woman drop in. I think Dan Mora is doing just such a fun, fun job. Uh, now, we don't have much other preview art. So uh, this story is setting up to be just... Uh, I feel like the next issue is really going to ramp it up. There's a reveal here towards the end uh, that kind of feels like, okay, this is where we're going with this. Uh, so, yeah. Really, really enjoyed this issue. I hope that everyone reading this can fully appreciate that sometimes comic books can just be really goofy, right? Uh, which is really interesting because Mark Wade is also writing the absolute power stuff. So, like, Mark Wade has the range to do something goofy and silly like this, uh, but still make it really cool, uh, but also just go all the way to the other side of things and uh, give us, like, this shape defining event like you know world uh like the absolute power stuff so i'm very excited to continue the story i want to know how these um uh how these beings end up playing their role because they have such specific relationships right batmite really is the number one fan of batman and but mr mixaplex he's really not a fan of superman if anything they're you know they're rivals so like interesting that there's a juxtaposition there uh, also, Robin heavily involved here as well. So, yeah, this is just really, really fun stuff. Really beautiful art. Uh, I think both Travis Mercer um, and, and uh, Dan Mora have a similar style uh, that allows this to just really work very cohesively. So, uh, if you have read this, let me know what you thought about it down in the comments. As always, thank you for watching, everyone. Remember to share, like, subscribe. Hit the bell so you know when we go live. That is most Saturdays, 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. Stay tuned. We have more comic reviews, trailer reactions, TV recaps, all that fun stuff in the channel. Thanks for watching, everyone. Bye-bye.